Hello everyone, I'm Storm Tracker Nicole Gomez, starting out with the latest feature track computer model to give you an idea when the showers are expected to roll in here. You can see by 430, Las Cruces, portions of Doniana County, far eastern portions of El Paso County, moderate rainfall is what we are tracking. Around 630, you could possibly even run into some freezing rain if you're traveling around eastern portions of El Paso County, Loop 375, and even the darker yellows that you see here indicating that we could see heavier rainfall later this evening around 830. But notice if you're traveling a little further north East, you could run into some light snow around the area mountains and again eastern portions, northeastern portions of the county with more moderate rainfall falling into Friday morning. Around 1.30 looks like we'll get a break, but don't be surprised if you run into just a few sprinkles out and about on the roadways. 11 o'clock in the morning, mostly cloudy skies, but it looks like we'll get a break from the rainfall, which is some good news if you do have plans to attend the Sun Bowl game. Saturday, we get our next round of showers moving through the area with the heaviest rain taking place around the Sacramento Mountains, but notice Las Cruces around lunchtime. You can see some heavier rainfall. So with the system that we are tracking, the winds are expected to pick up this afternoon. Temperatures cooler for today, and rain chances will stick around not only for today, but through the weekend. So here's a look at the forecast if you do have plans to attend the Sun Bowl game. Start of the game, 47 degrees. Make sure you take a poncho or a jacket. Rain chances sit at 20%, so don't want to completely rule that chance out of a sprinkle or two or maybe some light showers. And if you are headed to the game, be sure to download the ABC7 Storm Track Weather and Traffic app. You can check on current conditions before you head out and track the showers with the interactive radar. We'll run below average this afternoon and Friday, a little warmer on Saturday. Saturday, but temperatures running right where they should be around this time of year for the start of the new year. Taking a look at our ABC7 wind gust tracker, showing that on Friday, the wind's not too bad, but expect occasional breezes at 25 miles per hour for your Friday afternoon. But it will be windy this afternoon, gust at 40 miles per hour, breezy Friday with lighter winds in the forecast for Saturday. So here's your weekend forecast. El Paso, sponsored by the Mattress Firm. We're in the 60s Saturday, 50s on Sunday with overnight lows in the 30s. We're also in the 50s this weekend for Las Cruces. 40% chance for showers today for San Eli, Fort Blister on the map at 51, so temperatures throughout the entire region will be cooler. La Mesa 51 is what you can expect for today. We're in the 50s this afternoon, windy with a 40% chance for showers. The rain will stick around through the weekend. Slight chance for showers on Monday and Tuesday. It looks like we have another round of showers on Wednesday with a high of 56 degrees.